Hi, everyone. Um, I'm going to show you how you can use the color guide today. Uh, so this will be exercise nine. Um, I want you guys, before you open anything, just go find that Snap Fashion uh, image that I provided you with, and then go ahead and open a page. Now we're going to go back to the Snap Fashion, and I want to get my selection tool and select this image. And I'm going to bring it over here. And you want to make six copies of this. And I am using Command V -E or Control V to paste one side copy. OK, so we got six copies of this. Um, let me show you what I'm expecting you guys to do. Let's see. This is what we are going to be doing. Um, we're going to call it the color guide. And I'm going to use uh, the color guide and show you how you can use that to have complementary colors or more analogous colors uh, to combine. So that's what we're going to do. So let's go ahead and do all the work we have to do here. So I'm going to put a color guide here. Okay, let's do that. And then we can bring those a little bit down. OK, uh, you can always change the color of this if you like, of course. So let's make it red. And then we're going to write the names of each of those color guides that we are using down here. So. Let me first tell you about the color guide. I'm going to close all of this so that um, we can go. So if you don't see your color guide, go to your window and go select color. You want to see color. And then you can also say color guide. And the color guide will be here. So the colors are here. Color guide is here. So the color guide gives you some options. Um, you can actually click here. And you're going to see all these different color combinations it gives you. So um, this here is skin tones, colors that I have selected. So if you go here, you can select a theme right here. So I selected skin tones, but you can select, for example, let's do celebration. Okay. If you do celebration, these are the colors that come up. So out of these colors, you can select a pentagram, for example, compound, high contrast. Uh, there are triads. There's monochromatic, analogous, uh, left complement, right complement. So there are all these options that you can use. So for example, let's do the analogous colors for this first one, OK? So what I'm going to do is select this. And I'm going to color it to a color. So you can just select whichever color. And then you can go here and select certain parts of this. And for example, I'll make the sleeves this color. Um, I'll make that color, that color here. Now let's try this color and this color. Okay, so this was the 
analog is. So I'm going to write out. And I think I need to reduce the size of this a little bit. All right, and then we're going to do that for all the other ones. So for this one, let's see what we should do. We can go select a totally different theme. Um, we can do fruit. Okay, fruit comes up with this. So now you can click here and select Let's do a compound for this one. Okay, I'm going to select this. So I'll go ahead and do this color. And then you can go to this and select this color for the sleeves. Let's do this one red. We'll do this one that color. I mean, you can just play with it basically. This I'm going to do the dark color. Um, and we're going to call this compound. So I'm just copy pasting analog. I'm going to call this compound. OK. And then we go to our next one. Uh, we can continue with the fruit theme. For example, we can do high contrast so that you can see the differences. So I'm going to do high contrast on this one. Let's see, I do this. And then I'll go to sleeves. Sleeves, I'm going to make sleeves this color. I'm going to make it this color here. I'm going to make that this color. And maybe I'll do this. OK. So this one was high contrast. Okay, let's go to this one now. And we are going to do a pentagram. Okay, so I'm going to select this color for the main. Of course, you can be more creative and try to match the colors a little better. Um, I'm basically just showing you guys how this works. Um, so let's make the sleeves this color. I'm going to make the back this color. OK, I'll do this one here. And this one was pentagram. And let's go to this one. Um, we can do analog for fruits. So let's select this color and then go to this. We're going to do this. This.
Okay, this was another analog one. I would recommend that you do six different ones, but I just thought it would be good to see how, you know, these are kind of similar colors here when you select that option and then um, triad. Let's try and triad. So I'm going to do this one for this. And we're going to do blue here. Maybe red here. Okay, so this was a triad. All right, guys, this is it. So I want you guys to play with those color guides and uh, try six separate samples. I would recommend that you use this outfit. It's easier to change colors. So I'm going to go ahead and save as. And this is going to be exercise nine. Color guide. Okay.